Hey, it's John from RMUS. We're doing a test on a suppression system, basically a parachute that is going to deploy. This has been made for the Mavic 2 series. We want to just double check and make sure everything's working, systems are going, but just a initial, like who it's made by and what it is. This is called the Fly Fire Mantis 2, Manti 2. So it's an autonomous system, meaning that it doesn't actually connect to the drone to get any input on failure. Accelerometers inside will tell the, de the chute when to deploy. It's a very simple press on, turn it on, and it's ready to go. So we're about to test to make sure that it's actually going to deploy okay. So let's just see how that test goes. There it goes. We're in free fall. Okay, well the parachute deployed. It looks like we had an actual safe landing. I mean, let's just go ahead and assess that. Jake. Yep. Doing uh, test piloting, actually creating the action to do the failure and stop the motors in flight. So um, from what it looks like, it looks like it deployed correctly. I see no damage. What do you see? Camera's working well. The arms look fine. Antennas look good. No broken propellers. So. Uh -huh. And we yeah. landed in a soft area. So. Landed in a pretty soft area. It looks like the speed of arrest actually wouldn't have probably impacted very hard even if you were on cement or anything else it's well, probably pretty soft that, but yeah. yeah yeah so <laughs> basically a, a pretty good design for this overall very autonomous uh parachute system again the mantis manti 2 uh and then we'll get we'll go through a couple of other things about uh possibly repacking because this kit actually does come with a cover which obviously we lost and then a ballistic it's, it seems ballistic but there's a little cap little cap that goes off to get the chute out uh, in your noticing of this when we were actually doing this how many feet you think approximately it fell because we were at an altitude of what 200 feet AGL. 200 feet is when you created the motor shut down and how, how many feet do you think it we, we could probably have to review the video but maybe 100 so i would think 100 as well yeah. it fell almost 100 feet before it actually deployed the chute suppressed. and then there wasn't very much time for it to actually uh, open, and open up and suppress so so a minimum of i think the recommended minimum is 160 as far as the instructions go yeah as far as the instructions go okay 200 we could see that it did suppress the fall so yeah, well, well, we'll I would again call this a pretty good, good successful test as far as this little unit. Very simple, simple to install and simple for the design. So the Manti 2.